digital marketing strategies are diverse and change often, which means the skills digital marketers need to be successful are also diverse and change often. Digital marketers are like the Swiss army knives of marketing. While you may end up getting really good at one area of marketing, you should try to keep up with the latest strategies outside of your specialty. If you're getting into the digital marketing field or considering a career change or looking to validate your existing skills, this is the right video for you. You'll learn eight skills that every digital marketer should have. Don't worry if you're missing any of the skills on this list, all of them can be mastered with practice. Let's start with four soft skills, which are the less technical traits you should bring to your position. One, clear communication. If you don't communicate with your coworkers, bosses, customers, or audience clearly, you'll end up with a lot of confused people and plenty of questions to answer. Eliminate uncertainty by first never making assumptions about the people you're communicating with. A great example of this is using acronyms. When you think of the letters CIA, do you automatically associate them with the US government's Central Intelligence Agency, the Culinary Institute of America, or something else? Are you requesting a series of graphics from a designer by writing out your needs and expectations? We call these project specs. Be thorough here. Include your goals, ideal timeline, design inspiration, links to necessary files, and anything else the designer needs to be successful. The more details you include, the fewer questions you'll have to answer later on. Take some time to think about who you're communicating with and what information is essential to conveying your message. Two, organization. One digital marketing strategy can easily branch out into five, 10, maybe even 15 sub-strategies, some of which you'll learn a bit later in this video. Unless you work alone, you'll have to coordinate with other people who work with you on these strategies. Staying organized will help you manage all of the responsibilities on your plate and will also prevent you from missing important messages and deadlines. Being organized might not come naturally, and that's okay. Start small. Come up with a standard file system for your computer or organize your browser bookmarks in a way that makes things easier to access. Create a master spreadsheet with links to different projects, folders, websites, tools, or anything else you use to get the job done. Less clutter equals more time to focus on what matters. Three, time management. Digital marketers balance many different strategies at once. Knowing how to knock out your projects in a timely manner will keep you moving toward your goals. Prioritizing your projects can help you decide what requires the most time and what can be done later. You don't want to spend hours making minute changes to a low priority, low impact project while a more important campaign falls behind schedule. If you want to improve this digital marketing skill, try challenging yourself to finish something in a shorter time period than normal. Take notice of anything in your process that slows you down. If you find that you have a slow computer or you can make a template for a future project, invest a bit of time or money into eliminating those problems. Four, ability to adapt to change. Digital marketing looks nothing like it did five years ago. New marketing channels gain popularity, search engines update how they rank websites, advertising gets more competitive, and so on. As a digital marketer, you have to stay on top of these changes to succeed. Just because something worked 10 years ago doesn't mean it will yield the same results now. Testing your strategies can help you understand what works and what doesn't. It's also important that you continue to learn about the industry. So those are four soft skills. This next section of the video focuses on hard skills, which are more technical capabilities you bring to your role. One, ability to interpret data. Data is the foundation of digital marketing. It tells you how your campaign performs and helps you make better decisions for the future. Identifying trends and patterns in your marketing data can help you shift your strategy to maximize the impact it has on your bottom line. No matter what tool you use to gather data, it's important that you have data and can interpret what it means for your current digital marketing efforts. Two, 
content creation and writing. Content marketing is a big part of digital marketing. The content you create can be used across many marketing channels and can help turn more of your audience into your customers. Whether or not you expect to do it, you may end up writing blog posts, drafting ad copy, designing graphics, or editing videos for your clients. You may even update a website's code in the process. So an understanding of all these tactics can give you an edge over other marketers. Sure, you may work with a team of writers, designers, and developers, but you should have at the very minimum a basic understanding of how to create content for an audience. Plus, when you know what it takes to get something done, you'll have an easier time explaining what you're looking for when you request work from someone else. Here's an example of what I mean. If you've written a blog post before, you can pretty accurately estimate how much time someone needs for research, writing, editing, publication, and any other steps that lead to a finished product. Three, promoting a website in search engines. Search engine optimization, SEO, means using different tactics to help a website appear higher on search engine results organically, aka without paying for placement. Another aspect of search engine promotion is advertising, in which you pay for a website to appear in front of searchers. SEO is great because the work you do once can continue generating results over time. However, we wouldn't recommend optimizing a page once and never going back to it. Search engines change, and so do your competitors. You have to keep an eye on your website and optimize it on a regular basis to see lasting results. Advertising is great because it can reach a lot of people and hit goals over a short period of time. While your ads stop showing once your campaign ends, they're still very useful for promoting specific aspects of your business, like sales or new products or for filling in any marketing gaps while you wait for your SEO efforts to start driving significant results. Four, driving results through different social media platforms. Billions of people around the world use social media. To have a successful digital marketing career, you should familiarize yourself with, at the very least, a few popular social media platforms. Which ones to learn? I'll leave up to you. Social media is a great channel for sharing any content you've created. It gives you the ability to directly communicate with your audience, whether you respond to comments, messages, or answer common questions in your posts. Pro tip, if a lot of people ask you the same question via direct message, you should address it publicly. You may also want to dip your toes into social media advertising, which lets you leverage the detailed audience data different platforms collect to create targeted campaigns. These four hard skills can be learned. The soft skills I explained earlier can be learned too. Look for different courses online from reputable companies. Watch videos from people who have been in the marketing industry for years. Read publications that cover trends and updates in the industry. Find some books that cover the information you need to improve your digital marketing skills. Most importantly, remember that no one was born an expert in the field of digital marketing. I bet many digital marketers can say they were born before the whole industry started. Be patient as you learn new skills and don't put pressure on yourself to get everything right immediately. Digital marketing is all about testing things to see what works. Mistakes happen and ultimately make you a better marketer if you learn from them. To keep learning about the skills digital marketers need to be successful, subscribe to our YouTube channel and check out the playlists we have on a variety of topics. See you soon, marketers.